guys, this is Anthony Tejada, your local Orlando realtor. And today, we got a special one for you. We're here in the brand new models here at Reserve at Twin Lakes with Jones Homes USA. And this is a brand new community. I previewed some of it for you in some few uh, past videos. But today is before the grand opening of these models. They let us in just to show you, my faithful viewers. And this is the Woodmere 2. It's a five bedroom, three bath, two car garage cover patio two stories with an upstairs master right and it comes in at 2939 square feet now the base price of this model at the time of video is 599,990. this is the included features model so everything you see in this home you can practically get for base so come with me but before we start if you can press the subscribe and alert buttons down below it truly helps my channel and now let's go see this home hey guys so here we are at the Woodmere, which is a five bedroom, three bathroom, two car garage home. You see the garage is here set, but what I love is the roof structure, that modern slanted roof structure. It really makes the house stand out. Beautiful. Now guys, follow me. This is your beautiful driveway as you can see, but the pavers leading up to the porchway of the house. Look at this, guys. Enough space to sit out front with two chairs, have your coffee in the morning, those two windows for natural lighting for the first room. But before we walk into the house, I got to show off one of my favorite doors with the modern glass slats in it. I love that. And it's a black door. I like that. Yes. That's an elegant look. Now, guys, before we walk into this house, I got to remind you, aside for interior design features like the slat wall, this will be a plain wall. Everything in this house is at base, meaning you don't have to spend a dollar more for whatever you see in this house aside, aside from the pool in the backyard. Again, the designer features in this home and curtains, right? Everything else is the bones of the home and the way it comes. Like these tiles here, the 17 by 17 tiles is the base feature tile. Very beautiful. Now, I love this hallway, how wide it is. Very nice, lined up with high hot, high hots. <laughs> <laughs> it is hot outside. <laughs> and then when we get to this point of the home, we have a bedroom here, a closet here, and a bathroom straight ahead. So I will let Pam show you the closet and the bathroom. There's a little quick linen closet here. And a full bath. So your vanity. No, they made very good use of the space. Yeah. Here's your tub. And I love that this builder put the towel all the way up. You have to point that out. I am. <laughs> Not you, Pam, I'm just saying. <laughs> Ooh, she spiced it this morning, guys. <laughs> Make sure I do my job right. <laughs> and then there's the window for natural lighting and the commode on the side of it. Now, guys, as you head out of the bathroom, right, we have our first bedroom here. Again, one of the things I love about this builder is that the window starts at knee height, giving you much more window real estate. These double pane windows here out in the front with the decorative ironing is very nice. And we have our half step in over here in the corner, which is very nice. Lots of space in this room. The furniture is oversized. And I have to point out, these model in this community start with 10 foot ceilings at base. Hey, that's a great, great option. Makes the house feel more spacious. There's more room. You're not crunched in. <laughs> I'm six foot one, so I go into houses with an eight foot ceiling. I'm like, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys, now we get in here and the home opens all the way up. We have the stairways going up and we're gonna show you that in a minute, but I have to show you this family room it is gorgeous it opens all the way up look how much space there is two windows for natural lighting now pam's on the other side of this family gathering room pam can you even see me barely <laughs> uh, big tv just the way it's supposed to be it could be a little bit it could be a <laughs> pam wants a projector guys yes <laughs> and we're going to show you outside in a minute but then it crawls into your informal dining area in the open space here. I, you can't see me behind the weeds, so. <laughs> That's <laughs> decorative. They're I not know, I weeds. Know. <laughs> oh, I meant wheat. It looks like wheat. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> um, here's another two pane window here for natural lighting into that eating area. 
And then you can see this island. You can feed four people here easily. Is this where you turn? No. <laughs> no. That's a vine that's going to strangle you. <laughs> I'm talking to the green thumb behind the camera. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. I love that the quartz wraps around the whole kitchen area. Now, this is not a gourmet, but it's still nice. I love that the microwave's on top. Again, upgraded Samsung appliances. Love this gas range. Gas That's again nice. in here. Nice. Yes. Yeah. This is a gas community, but I love the way it looks. It's just, it's just bulkier. It's, mm, it's manly. <laughs> you uh, get the, gas, the smells to go out of the home, as you can see here. So it's vented. Very nice. Love that feature. Right? You got your 42 inch cabinets, but if you spin around, you do have a small window for natural lighting in the kitchen area, which I know some people who are washing the dishes here in this deep dish sink would appreciate looking out into their backyard space. Now I'm, I'm enjoying the, the, the length of the uh, Yeah, it wraps here. all the way it? around. What do you call these things? Countertops? Countertops, thank you. <laughs> See, I, she knows plants, <laughs> I know countertops, okay? <laughs> so here's your dishwasher here. And then here's your fridge. Uh, oh, and all these appliances come included at base price. Refrigerator, also the dishwasher, all your appliances, very nice. Now this leads out to your garage space. And then this is your utility closet for your AC. I like that it's elevated. Very nice. Somebody's coming to visit. Yeah. <laughs> and then we have our pantry here. That is under the stairs, very nice. All right, guys, so before we go upstairs, I wanna show you the outdoor space here. Now, obviously, this is not included with the home except for the covered lanai space, but there are some options here that you might wanna take advantage of. First, these dual sliding on each side doors. I love that, the whole mm -hmm. feel. Then the outdoor kitchen with the T-wall, obviously that's an option but the cover lanai is as it is, it comes as it is, right? Now the pavers, this is not the color pavers that come with the home, it's more like what's in the front driveway, which is like a harvest color. But guys, look at the size of the yard and what you get for it and what you can do with it. Love this pool with the jacuzzi. Look at this, look at this. this uh, There's a water feature in that. Yeah, like this gazebo with the water feature, that's amazing. But the part that I love, Right, well show the space first, Pam. Lots of space, you got more, like another 20 feet back there, right? But look at the seating area with the jets and the table with the umbrella holder. Oh, you can't, you can't beat that with a stick. No. Very nice. Seating area all around the pool area. So imagine your July 4th, your Labor Day weekends, barbecuing, hanging in the pool, having a good time with family and friends. This is what it's all about, guys. This is why you get these kind of houses. Love it. All right. So now we're definitely going upstairs. Give me a second and I'll meet you up there. All right, guys, so as we get to the second floor, as you can see, I'm gonna have Pam do a pan real quick. And you can see that the hallway is open with that little pony wall that cuts off the wall. Very nice. And we're going to head into the room right in front of the stairway first. Love the little window for natural lighting. But as you can see, they made this like a little gathering room, craft, study, room. craft room, study area. But it is a bedroom because there is a closet here. It's a half step in. You can see that. And I'm gonna move out of Pam's way. There's two windows for natural lighting. I love the built-ins. Again, 10, 10, uh, 10 foot ceilings, oh my goodness, um, are in the second floor as well, so you don't lose space there. And as we head out of the room, I like, there's a lot of room here. So you could put like another chair here. I don't know why you would sit in the hallway, but who knows, a lot no, of people. because it's nice. Like, yeah, like read. a reading area, yeah. right? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I, I thought I was dumb, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Here's another room here that's uh, set up as a kid's room as well. And there is a window for natural lighting. 
like the moon design. That's very nice. That's it. Yeah, that's very cool. And then we have this um, half step in closet here. Pushing forward. Now, this hallway has lots of space. Like, even at the pony wall, you have lots of space in between, as you can tell. Go ahead, Pam. It's great for moving furniture yeah. from room to room. And there's another thing, right? This home, as I told you downstairs, it's all at base, right? So that's why you have a pony wall. But if you chose to spend a little bit more money, you can make this with the wrought iron and wood. So it's all kind of like see-through, right? And that's the small upgrade. So, I mean, if you have nothing else to spend, I would do that. Now, here's your full bathroom here. Again, continuing with the base colors and tile, and it still looks awesome. What, what helps is the high ceilings. Yes. Look at the tile all the way up. Love that. With the niche on the back side of the tub, you have your commode and your window for natural lighting. The dual vanity with this base quartz. Base, I'm at, you know, a builder that gives base quartz anymore? No. That's amazing. Also, you have all this cabinetry, love that. All these are functional, right? Very nice. All right, heading out. Now we have a T here, and I think we're gonna go this way first, and we're gonna go into our domestic suite. Which is really big. Yes. And the thing about the domestic suite here with this builder is what you see is how it comes. So that utility sink included, the folding table on the side included, right? And this other base table here with all the cabinetry on the bottom is included. And the machines. Yeah, wash and dryer is included. Mm -hmm. Tile, love the tile. And no closet there. <laughs> just checking, just checking. And as Pam moves out of the domestic suite, she's gonna show you some of these linen closets here. Well, there's one linen closet, and then there's one AC utility closet right here. And I know they're just closets, but I like that they're elevated, keeps the water dripping from the floor, all right? We're gonna pass this room and come straight back into this room that's set up as a nursery. Again, window for natural lighting and your half step in here. Yep, One thing I just want to point out, there's no lights on in this room and it's still bright. Yeah, you get all the light you need coming in. Sorry, I'm in your way. That's okay. Uh, in to this home. So it's very nice. I like the way they designed it. Very nice, very cutesy. I love the bunny rabbits. <laughs> He's a little bunny rabbit. Yeah. Very nice. I like him too. He's a Perfect nice thing rabbit. for Easter. No, I used to have a bunny rabbit. <laughs> Seriously, in, in Manhattan. Oh, yeah? Yeah, his name was Thumper. <laughs> All right, now, guys, we enter that next room. Look at the size of this primary bedroom suite. The two windows here and the other window give enough light into this room. And we have a walk-in closet on this side, but you have, like, a whole sitting area here. Great. Look how much space there is. Yeah, this is nice for my morning coffee. <laughs> Look out the window, see what the neighbors are doing. Who's driving by. Oh, and there's a window. There's a window in the, in the uh, walk-in closet as well. I just want to point out, this is, guys, this is how big this room is. This is two cadenzas side by side and a king size bed. And also, the, what, the usefulness of this 10 foot ceiling where they did the tray and the uh, brace bars across. I love that. Very nice. Now all they need is the TV right here. <laughs> no, no TV in the bedroom. What? Well, for me? No. I watch late night shows, so for no. me, yes. <laughs> I, I go to bed to sleep. We disagree on this. Yes. <laughs> all right, and here is your full bath suite here. There was your commode. There is your dual vanity, your mirrors. A transom window in the middle of the mirrors for natural lighting, of course. And behind Pam is your walk-in shower. 
This, oh, wow, it's big. Yeah. Oh, and you have a bench. Yep, what? bench, yeah. That was a surprise to me. Yeah, it's a little bit more than a walk-in shower, it's a jogging shower. Yeah, <laughs> enough for five. Yeah, I like the little niche in the corner, very nice. And Pam, we have another closet here. Oops. So, whose closet is this, Pam? The one who has the most clothes. Okay. <laughs> Nice. I like the window. Yeah, transom window. Lots of space in this closet, love it. And your data panel, obviously, for all your control stuff here. But that is the home, guys. Please stay tuned, because I got a couple more words for you, and I will see you in two seconds. All right, guys, so this was the Woodmere 2, this gorgeous house that you just saw, that is the Included Futures home. If you have any questions, give me a call at 407-790-0929. Anthony Tejada, your local Orlando realtor, and I will see you guys in the next video.